Mongoose Jake here, back with another review after a short break, not of my own choosing due to COVID. But I actually want to take a look at the Busby Jolt, better known as the Panther. Now, those of us who are long-time foam-flinging fanatics will remember that the Busby Panther was actually a pretty highly sought-after little blaster. It was an air-powered little pistol that, even today, can be modified for good performance. The Panther that we get now today comes in a couple of different ways. You can get this two-pack, which is the most common way. It's available for $5 at Dollar General, but there's also four packs available at other other retailers. But I picked mine up. Actually, I have like about four or five of these packs now. I picked mine up for $5 at my local Dollar General myself. And what you get is you get a optional blue and red. It's kind of a tag team set. Now, there are other color schemes out there, but this is the common one you're going to find. And again, what's your $5 get you is the two pistols, as well as six of the included Busby Long Distance Darts. That's the traditional uh, blue foam, yellow tip. With a claim range of 65 feet, these will actually hit that if you angle up at a full 45 degree angle, load your dart in, and fire. They will actually hit that range with the included long distance darts. So I guess kudos for a genuine claim. Now keep in mind all range claims from every company are always up at an angle under ideal conditions. But it's a simple little pistol that is a rear prime spring powered front loader. Now it basically does fill the exact same role of the Nerf Jolt. This the Busby Panther is a little pocket-sized pistol that you could easily hide away anywhere. I mean, I'm wearing a button-up shirt. <laughs> it's like I could put one in there. And that, that's what it's for. It's, you know, inexpensive, easy to stash, and easy to load. I mean, this is this could be literally somebody's very first blaster for a, a, a younger user. It's got a nice T-handle. We'll come in real close there. And... That T-handle makes it really easy to pull, especially because you're pulling in line with your arm. So it makes it pretty easy for somebody who might be using this as their first blaster. Now, keep in mind, you get two for $5, so these are $2.50 per. That's a heck of a deal. Now, performance-wise, I've put a number of these over the chronograph. and my latest session, right before this video... I got a low of 57.5 and a high of 68.5. Most of them were going to fall in the 63-64 range with an overall average of about 63.5 feet per second. So basically performance right in line with the Jolt because the Jolt gets about 63, 64, 65. So this really is the Busby Jolt for all intents and purposes. Now keep in mind your current Busby Panther in the two pack. Yes, you do have to spend the five dollars to get the two pack. That's two dollars and fifty cents per pistol. Now, the Jolt and the new Nerf, newer Nerf Stinger, are all four dollars each. I actually just went out and bought a few. I'm going to do a comparison video, and it's hard not to include some of that sprinkled in here. But this is a more economical version you know, for all intents and purposes with the equivalent performance and instead of the bottom pull of the Jolt, you got the rear prime. So this may be preferable for a lot of people. And on its own, just reviewing the two that you get for five dollars, they're solid options to be able to stuff in a pocket and you know use as a you know last second shot. Grab it. If especially if it's preloaded, grab it and fire. Now I have actually even modified one of these and got it to shoot significantly harder. It is a little more difficult because it is solvent welded all the way around. So modding purposes, they're a little harder. But yes, I have one with a brass barrel and an upgraded spring. And it cures one thing. You're able to load any dart you want. And it has a nice little pump punch to it and a little ting. I absolutely love that. But, yeah, I did modify one of these, and I do have a, a little bit older guide on that, because it was a couple years ago. But the Busby Panther, available for $5 in a 2-pack from your local Dollar General, or in 2 and 4-packs from other retailers. What can I say about it other than, 
I actually like this better than the Jolt. And I'm not a Nerf hater. I actually love the Jolt. So that says a lot. But it's at least equivalent in a little bit different form factor. So something to keep in mind. If you want a little single shot pistol, the Busby Panther might might just suit the purposes you want it for. Let's move shake with a quick little review of the Busby Panther. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it.